This is a problem regarding the interpretation of a situation where there's a derivative involved. So we have a yam that's been taken out of the oven and is cooling off before being eaten. The temperature T of the yam measured in degrees Fahrenheit is a function of how long it has been in the oven and where T is measured in minutes. Thus we have T equals F of T. Now before you start problems, actually think about the yam being taken out of the oven and what happens to its temperature. I mean, most people should have some sort of experience in their life about taking something from a hotter place and letting it cool off in a cooler place. So you just think, have to think about what f of t is doing as time passes. And so the idea of cooling, f of t is decreasing for every minute the yam's been in the oven. I'm sorry, the yam's been in the room. So the question is, is f prime of t positive or negative and why? Well, since we said that f of t is decreasing as time passes, the temperature of the yam is decreasing. So that means that f prime of t has to be uh, negative. And that's simply because the temperature of yam is decreasing. Anytime a function is decreasing, let's just draw a little picture of a decreasing function here. You take any tangent line at any point and you can see that the tangent slope of that tangent line is negative. So that means f prime is negative. What are the units for f prime of t? Well, we have to take into consideration the units of t and f of t to do this. So f of t is in degrees Fahrenheit, which is capital T, the temperature. And then the time is measured in minutes, which is t. So you can always think of f prime of t as a small change in output over a small change in input. That's why we use the little d's, small change. So the unit of measure for temperature is degrees Fahrenheit. The unit of measure for time is minutes. So the unit of measure for my derivative is degrees Fahrenheit per minute. Always works that way, by the way, people. You can always interpret a derivative as a slope, change in output over change in input. It's just a tiny change, tiny change. Okay, part C. Interpret the meaning of f of 3. Now when we say interpret, we want complete sentences, not half thoughts. Okay, so when I'm going to interpret f of 3 equals 80, this is just the function itself, nothing fancy. So I always start with talking about what the input says. So after three minutes, three minutes have passed. The temperature of the yam. Is 80 degrees Fahrenheit. All right, now the second one. That's F prime of three equals negative four. Now we know from part B, the unit of measure on this guy is degrees Fahrenheit per minute. The negative implies the fact that the temperature is decreasing. And this is my input, so that's where I'm starting. After three minutes, the temperature, because that's what that is, that's tell, telling, telling me about the temperature. The temperature of the yam is decreasing at a rate of four degrees Fahrenheit per minute. So in other words, at that time, the yam is, uh, so after one minute passes, it'll approximately change in degrees, four degrees. Downward, so instead of being 80, it'll be approximately 76 after those three minutes. Now part three gives us this strange information that most people don't like. Let's see, where am I? Can you see that? No. F prime of five is less than zero, and F double prime of five is greater than zero. So here we have the input is changed at five, but the fact that f prime is less than zero means that the temperature is decreasing. And f double prime being greater than zero says my rate is increasing. 
So this the signs of the derivatives always tells you about whether or not the previous function with one less derivative is increasing or decreasing. So you can state this in one succinct sentence. It says after again start with the input after five minutes the temperature of the yam is decreasing at an increasing rate. Now actually that doesn't make a whole lot of sense if we know anything about Newton's law of cooling, but that's what the question is asking. After five minutes, the temperature is decreasing at an increasing rate.